Yeah, I can finally turn the air conditioner back on. Mm -hmm. The puppies are watching the show. It's fine. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I didn't ask either. Yeah, like that moderation. <laughs> yeah, so. moderation. All right, so it's all going. Yeah, so I ended off, you know, there's a lawsuit happening to try to restore the Bank of Canada. And, uh, you know, we really need to uh, go to community currencies and... Yeah, there's a lot of options out there. You know, like we, like Libya used to lend before. Um, yeah, before the whole NATO intervention in Libya, uh, there was no usury. They didn't have a central bank. They owed the IMF zero dollars. Within three weeks of NATO going in and attacking, they had a central bank set up, and they'd already been loaned three hundred billion dollars. Yeah. And the glo I guess the globalists didn't like uh, Gaddafi's intervention with uh, Africa. Trying to build yes. them up with their own uh, standard, wasn't it gold, gold standard, standard currency? Yeah. It wasn't a gold standard, it was actually a gold currency. <laughs> so, uh, what was it called? The dinar? Yeah. So, but I mean, NATO can only avoid it for so long. Look at the BRICS right now. Uh, the alliance between who is it? China, Russia, Brazil, India, I can't remember, there's a couple others. But well, that's going to rival IMF. So, I mean, things are happening. Keep your eyes and ears open. Check out the Canadian Action Party, uh, and we'll keep you posted as much as we can about the lawsuit and everything else. And the uh, Canadian Action Party on their website, they have a nice short little comic, nice little comic book uh, explaining how the Bank Canada works and even history, uh, historical times, you know, how, how the bank was uh, ripping off people, stuff like that, how usury was, you know. What's the website? Uh, actionparty.ca. There we go. Done.